morning and welcome to the farm today guys we are in the chicken coop it's a chilly morning but the chickens want to go outside so we're going to open their inside door and let them run good morning chicken have a snack today Looks like the chickens are enjoying their morning snack. Let's go feed the goats. So we thought we had the answer to the dryer vent and the dogs when we bought a metal dryer vent cover. Well, they outsmarted me again. They pulled off all the little fins. I guess when the dryer was running, they were blowing and somebody wasn't that happy with it. So now I get to try and fix it again. The girls sound very excited this morning, so we're going to grab them some breakfast and go say hello. And we can't forget their crackers. Okay girls, here comes your breakfast. Miss Nova, I didn't forget you. How was your night? You girls sure are fluffy these days. Hmm? Get down, Nova. <laughs> Nova, you're catching it in midair. They're like, what does Lily have? Got you girls some hay. It's nice and sunny out there. You girls want to go outside in your run? You go and play for a bit? The girls always think that it's something they can eat. Or that's going to kill them, one of the two. One of the, yeah, exactly. It either means, either means food or death. They don't like the broom. <laughs> They're like, there's a broom in here. It's a gorgeous sunny fall day out there. So we're going to take advantage of that. And we're going to try and get some things done around the farm today. One of the things we have to get done before winter is we need to make the fence in the backyard for the dogs higher. Now last year the snow was so deep that the dogs could just walk right over the four foot fence and out into the main fields, which really is fine. They're not going to go anywhere, but we don't want them to have access to the road in case of a car or something like that. So what we're going to do is use some free wood that we got from our local home building store and also a roll of free chicken wire that was in their scrap bin the last time we were there just to extend the fence a couple feet higher so that the dogs can't walk over the fence when the snow gets really deep. One thing about northern climates is that fences take a beating. Now this fence was only a few years old and already it is falling apart. As you can see, <laughs> the dog, and it needs to be fixed. Fences are really expensive, so it's not something we're gonna do right away. This fence is just to keep the dogs in one yard so that they're separate from the rest of the animals and the rest of the farm. Today, we're going to take some of our free wood though, and we're going to patch the fence. Because that's much better than replacing it. <laughs> Patch, patching always works. <laughs> patching always works. It's like duct tape for your fence. <laughs> okay, like well, anywhere? it's a big project today, and we better get started. The only reason we have to do that is because of this guy right here. This because one. of Freddy. Freddy. Are you trouble? Hey. 
Yeah, he's a kangaroo. Yeah. This guy can he jump can like jump. six feet high. Yeah, ridiculous. This time of the year is the perfect time of the season to get things done on the homestead. October, November, before the snow starts flying. And today we're going to take advantage of the beautiful weather and get this project done because we got a bunch of other projects we still need to get completed before the snow starts flying in the next month or so. types of tools that I like to use here on the homestead and I recommend the Stanley product and this is the fat max line this is the hammer stapler I have the pry bar these tools last I've had these for years and they have not broken down on me even once what makes the fat max product a really easy hammer stapler to use is simply loading it push in pop up slide out load your staples in there you're ready to go just that easy if this ever broke on me, which I doubt it would, I would buy another one of these from Stanley instantly. So you can see, we only got about halfway covered with wire before our free roll ran out. I really thought it would be long enough. Apparently, I'm blind. I told you it wouldn't be long enough. Yeah, 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 you did. <laughs> But we got part of it done, I guess. The rest will have to wait till we get to town the next time and pick up another roll. <clears throat> now this is just a visual deterrent for the dogs. I don't actually expect the chicken wire to hold them back if they really wanted to go. But I hope it's just enough so they don't walk over the fence when the snow's really high. You're doing a good job out there. Are you supervising, Freddy? Karma, you just want to play. Back up. Good dog. You can see one of our crab apple trees down here has pretty much lost all its leaves, but it's still covered in apples. It looks so weird. There's no leaves on it, but all these tiny little apples everywhere. I bet in the next couple of windstorms they'll all get knocked off. So weird. So we got everybody's water changed. It's late in the afternoon, so it's time to do eggs. It looks like the girls had a great laying day today. Are you ready to collect? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see how many there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's a lot of eggs. Good job, Maya. Nine eggs today. That's almost a full day for us. That is. That means just one of those lazy chickens out there <laughs> didn't lay an egg. But nine is a great day, so I'll take it. With winter time coming soon, it sure is getting dark earlier. It's only just six o'clock and the sun is already down below the trees. With that, it's time to put the chickens away. Hello, girl. Can you just nicely walk inside for me? Up, up, up. 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 Good job, girl. I'd have to say tonight was a success. <laughs> much better than last night wasn't it well some nights are really good and other nights you chasing them around the yard 
I think the difference is yesterday we put them in way earlier because of the storm and today it's actually like getting dark so they're like oh, okay we'll go inside That's I hear I hear a lot a lot of noise coming from the goats we we got to go check on them pretty quick Let's go look it, at them something doesn't sound right they sound like they're screaming yes so the girls are being super loud so I think we're gonna put them to bed now and give them a snack so maybe they'll be quiet then we go back, check on the chickens and check for eggs and lock them up. <laughs> They're so loud. What's up, girls? We were in a panic to come check on you guys. You guys are being so loud. What's going on? It's bedtime. Let's go. You know the drill. Come on. Inside, girls. Good girls. See, they easy. Tonight they are. Some nights they're not. They were going crazy just a second ago. Like there was a wild animal in the backyard or something. I was like <laughs> I panicking. Like a bear or something. I was like, I gotta go something. check on the goats because something doesn't sound right. Well, let's go inside. Let's give them a snack. We did all their waters today. Yep. We'll go back, check for any late eggs, and head in the house. And have dinner ourselves. And have dinner ourselves. Sounds like a plan. We're gonna go inside and shut the girls' inside door. We're gonna check and see if there's any more eggs. I doubt it because we already had nine today, but there's that one lazy chicken that may have laid one more egg for us. Hello, chickens. You got stuff in your water already. The girls are all tucked in. They have food and water. We're gonna go and check on the goats and tuck them in and say goodnight. Giving the girls a bedtime snack. Yeah, just a little. They ate all their pellets today pretty much, so I'm gonna give them a little extra. Can you hear Nova jumping off the door? I do. She thinks I'm gonna bring her crackers. She's gonna be sadly mistaken. Yes. You girls being crazy? What did you think I brought you? It's not crackers. There you go. Have a snack. Thanks for hanging out on the farm with us today, guys, as we got some chores done in preparation of winter. <laughs> There's a lot of pushing <laughs> and shoving. <laughs> panda, panda, panda. If you want to see more fun videos of the girls, check out some of these videos over here. We'll see you guys tomorrow. As always, thanks for watching.